in the end, it was smothered off her boot. Lalawifi will go in for the Blues. Hosking tried to get it to Presparkas. Wilson had to turn around and wait for the football. Puts it into the path of Sarah Hosking. It'll sit for her. Bodie tries to run her down. Lost her footing. And here's the dangerous Fark again. Inside 50. McAvoy. Tackled by Arnell. Gets it to boot. Finds Presparkas. She's taken down. Wilson. The Blues having to work overtime in the back half here to win it clear. And eventually they do through Hosking. Working as a Steve Door on the... Steve Door rather, on the docks in Brisbane. Harrington, the quick restart to Jess Hosking. She goes to her sister, Sarah, slapped away from Conan. Plain, great tackle, Conan. Managed to pin the handball. You could see Plain was just ready to pop it out to Sarah Hosking, but Conan's timing on that was perfect. Pinned the arm and made the ball drop. Absolutely, and I'm so impressed by the defensive effort of these Lions forwards. It, it would be very pleasing for the coaching staff to see them, yes, in attack. They're creating the leads and getting the ball in there, but on I guess transition, they're defending harder and locking the ball in their forward half. Really bothering the Blues with their physicality early. Carlton slow starters last week and they came home like a steam train. Mm. Hosking. It's not that the Blues are particularly playing badly, Abs. No. It's just Brisbane are giving them no breathing room whatsoever. It's their pressure, isn't it? They're just bringing it and Carlton are a little bit shell-shocked at the moment. Sarah Hosking won the free kick for that tackle. Flirts with the line. Time to spoil well. Pound with the outside of her boot. Bushner's mark paid. Ran off the line, chips the kick, but she and Postlethwaite not on the same page. Sarah Hosking cuts it off, and once again, the chance for the Blues to pin Brisbane in their own defensive half. Hosking's kick in the Wushner direction. Again, it's an important little hand in there from Harris. Feet free. Lutkins arrives. Solid hit on her from Sarah Hosking. Postlethwaite to Webb. Into the path of Anderson. G to try and close her down. Anderson kicked towards O'Dwyer. New Pound was coming the other way. It was a really clever little tap onto herself. Pound did well, won it at ground level. Good slick move there from Hosking to turn inside. Lalawifi, little chip to Hosking. And once again, the Blues can control it. This is Sarah. So all the players basically in the front half of the ground for the Blues. Yeah, she just couldn't see those jumpers for the block for the Lions. Chris Barkas had to wait on Harrington's kick, fit it to Downey, now Hosking and Hosking to G. Stevens at ground level, as she's done a couple of times today, hits up, then wins it on the deck. And she now delivers to Sarah Hosking. Well, that was excellent work by Nick Stevens, wasn't it? She was under pressure, she was hot, but she managed to shimmy and shake her way out of it. Steady up and hit a target inside 50. Well done. Let's get a look at what the breeze is doing now. Looks pretty still at the moment. We'll check down with them shortly, but not as much as there was in the opening half. So Hosking from 45 will pop it right up to the square. Steven stays off the contest there. She's really sore grabbing at that left ankle as Loins will kick it towards 50. Hosking coming in one direction. Five seconds left on the clock. Back to Bates. High kick into space. Can the Lions get on the end of this? Sarah Hosking's tracking it back. She'll get there first. She's got some support, it's Dalton. Ball from behind on Spark, who wins it at ground level. Stripped of it by Hosking. Carlton ball. Lutkins goes in the Conway direction. Could only get one arm up. And gave away the free kick with a nudge in the back. It's a brave effort here from Sophie Conway to come back on. That left shoulder clearly a huge concern for her. Couldn't get the other arm above the head. Some balls with Sarah Hosking. Goes short. Find loins. 